episode of Backstage Bite is brought to you by the In The Raw family of sweeteners. Woohoo! Whoa, Daffodil! Good morrow, Squire. I am Lady Katie of Backstage Bite. I seem to have lost my way. I am searching for the kingdom of Arcadia. I have been summoned by Sir Jeremy Kushner. He is expecting me post hence. What's that you say? Follow the beat. <laughs> oh, it seems Daffodil has found the beat. Oh, good morrow. You. Oh my goodness! I'm so happy to have you in my kitchen. I'm really excited. Good, you came to the right place. Good. What were you like as a little kid? Shorter. You... <laughs> you know, always sort of doing this, like with a video camera in our living room and like me and my brothers. Sorry RuPaul, but we were doing Drag Race way before you were in my living room. I remember like, oh my God. We, would, like we would like dress up and we would lip sync songs. <gasps> and it was always like either Cyndi Lauper or Madonna. I mean, um, what did your outfit? Like. I mean, it was like straight out of like girls just want to have fun like that straight out of that video So it was like, you know, like one glove mesh with the, some kind of wig that we found like from a Halloween store it was Well now it's like literally drawn you into the perfect show now, now. I'm back, Yeah, and I get I definitely get the prettiest costume in the show. I'm not going to lie the straight white old man That's the prettiest costume in head over heels. How much do you know about cooking and baking? I love cooking and baking. Yeah. yeah. I haven't cooked a lot recently, but I love cooking at home. I love cooking, I like baking. Well, today we are going to make, we've got the beet chips. Awesome. I love it. I love beets. I'm Ukrainian by heritage. Really? So yeah, so beets and potatoes, that's basically all they eat. Yes. I'm ready. Let's do it. Okay. All right, sir. I'm going to start you off real easy. Okay, great. Please. Peel the beet. Speaking of beets. Yes. The, oh, my finger. That's awful. No, that I'm was sorry. so mean I'm because sorry. the beat is really red. The beat is really red. The beat is what drives them. What drives you? Oh, They've got the beat. Vodka. You've got the. <laughs> no. uh, what drives me? Yeah. Love. It's true. I have two little girls who I love with my whole you heart. Do. Yeah, they're amazing. Pamela Laura. and Philoclea. Pamela and Philoclea. <laughs> Actually, they are very much like Pamela and Philoclea. So, yeah, so love of them, love of work, love of the arts, love of. Yeah. That was really nice. So now comes a fun time. You are going to shred mm. your beet into nice thin chips. All right. Yeah. Okay. Nice. I feel like I work in a deli. I mean, you've been in this industry for a long time. New York for 20 years, yes. you were in Rent. Do you have a favorite career memory? Yeah, I, the people that I've gotten to meet along the way is really absurd to me. You know, like, you know, we were the other day, the, uh, the Go-Go's came on stage and they performed with us into the show, but they were doing their, their sound check before the show and there I am and there's Jane Weedlin and, and, and Charlotte Caffey and Belinda and they're, and they're like, oh, hey, Jeremy, how are you doing? I'm like, Go-Go's know my name. Like, how did Belinda Carlisle knows, knows my name? name. So I need you to like move these around in the water because we're trying to get some of the starch out. I can't wait to get on the subway after this and be like, somebody. <laughs> what happened? They're such funny names in this show. I know, it's great names, aren't they? They're, yeah. They're fun. Wait, I love them. You have to come up with your personal Greek name. What My would own? it be? Yeah. Jeremilius. Ooh. Maximus. Jeremilius Maximus, king of? Uh, beats. <laughs> All right, sir. Yes. Now we're going to prep for our frying. Okay. Over medium heat, okay. I need you to give me like this much oil in the bottom of your pan. So essentially like two cups. All right, so while we wait for this to heat up, mm -hmm. so Musidorus dresses as a woman. So yes. if you had to gender bend yes. with another female currently on Broadway, Oof. who would you change with? One of them would be Bernadette Peters. Um, but for sure, Rachel York is pretty cool. Either of the girls, at Frozen, I think both of those girls are amazing. Casey Ooh. and Patty, I think, are incredible. Which role would you rather play? They probably cast me as an Elsa, and I'd be like, the, oh, what you got the icy blue eyes. I do have the I, I do like the blue. <laughs> there is that. So <laughs> we had to protect his beautiful blue shirt. Yeah, I was re realizing that I'd made it this far without getting beats. And then on you me. jinxed yourself. Because we do have the beats. Okay. Yes, sir. Yes. I need you to start, and literally, we're gonna fry your beats. So when they mushroom. Flip so them and then they're gonna fill with bubbles and when it stops bubbling is when you pull them out. Good. Oh great, that's easy. Yeah, that looks gorgeous. Amazing. Look at those beet chips. So there's an oracle 
There is. In your show. So if you went to an oracle, <laughs> what would you want to know about your future? Um, I would want to know that I and the people around me were going to be happy and relatively successful in them and have not a lot of worries. That would be one of the things I would want to know. Yeah. Perfect. I would also hope that my kids were smarter than me. <laughs> <laughs> Look at how good that looks. I know, they're beautiful. They they're really are. Really and the gorgeous. colors are actually even cooler than they were before. Now that these are out of the oil, you are going to let them sit for about 10 minutes to really dry out. Okay. And while we do that, we are going to play my favorite game called Quick Fire Questions. 30 seconds on the clock. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Set. Go. How do you take your coffee? Black. Sweet or salty? Sweet. Clumsy or graceful? Clumsy. Favorite season? Spring. Phone call or text? Text. Skydive or bungee jump? Skydive. Morning person or night owl? Uh, night owl. Favorite pizza topping? Pepperoni. Last thing you do before you fall asleep? S snore. Boxers or briefs? Uh, briefs. Favorite subject in school? Nothing. Salad or french fries? Salad. How do you like your steak cooked? Medium. Ooh, drink of choice? Uh, martini. Inside or outside? Outside. Beer or wine? Beer. Tie or bow tie? Bow tie. What do you order at Chipotle? Oh! You got there so many! Add them to a big bowl, and now it's time to season them super deliciously. What to you is the message that you personally are going to take on the show? I think that the understanding that people's um, gender or sexuality or however they choose to appear as their authentic selves in public. Mm -hmm. Whatever they feel comfortable, I feel like it's it's important to to really make an effort to embrace that. And then people like Peppermint who are teaching me to you know be more open to stuff outside of my purview. So I, I'm really excited to be a better person after this show. And I'm not just saying that. Like That's I actually really really feel like that. with salt okay. and cayenne pepper. No measurements, Whee. it's to taste. You in the show go on an epic journey. If you were going on an epic, epic long journey, mm -hmm. what are your three must-haves? Music, for sure. I love, uh, I, I like to have music with me all the time. I love games. So, <gasps> me too. Yeah, some kind of board game and probably Settlers of Catan is one oh. of them. Yeah. Oh, my, my loves. Aww. Yeah, for sure. That counts as one. Yeah. That's good. Yeah, okay. Aww. It's time to mix all of these together. Oh. And it's time to mix this! All right. Yeah. All right, here we go. We're mixing. Woo. I feel like one of those salad guys. Yeah. Whoa, these look Work. so good. Oh, they look amazing. Cheers. Ding. Ooh, that one's pretty. Yeah. <gasps> They're all pretty. Mm. Oh, that's mm. really good. <laughs> I was ready to fake, like, ooh, that's delicious. No, these are No, really those good. are actually so delicious, right? Mm. We got the sweet, we, we got, got the sweet, sweet beets. And the beet. And, mm, yeah. That's good, yeah. yeah mm. Oh my god, how do I follow you? Oh, you can follow me just at Jeremy Kushner on Instagram and Twitter. That's so simple. Yeah. Oh um, my god, Head Over Heels. And Head Over Heels, you can follow Head Over Heels at H-O-H -H Musical, um, both on Instagram and Twitter. Um, so easy. Yeah. And don't forget to follow us. Yeah, we're doing it. Backstage fight. Done. So simple. Done. Oh, you were so much fun. Thanks so much. Oh my gosh. Thank you so oh, much. You are so welcome. You must, must go get your tickets to go, go to see Jeremy Kushner in Head Over Heels on Broadway at the Hudson Theater. Yes. Yay! Up now. Backstage bite. Woo! That was so good. Hey, thanks for watching Backstage Bite, brought to you by my favorite family of sweeteners, In the Raw. For more information, visit intheraw.com.